blue glasses. Today we're gonna unbox uh, the uh, this new chippy phone unlock phone that I purchased from Amazon. As you see, well, it's normal Amazon box, but it does have a caution here for lithium ion battery. It could explode. Do not load or transport package if damaged. Okay, so let's um, open this baby. The reason I got this was because my Samsung S6 uh, for some reason lost its IMEI number. And uh, after a couple of attempts to fix it with, you know, firmware reflashing and all that stuff, and you know, it, it uh, just didn't work. I didn't want to take any chances. I want to be able to use the uh, texting and phone capabilities without destroying the other, the old phone, because uh, I need it for my business. And therefore, um, I got this thing to uh, test out. So here is the blue advanced 5.0 unlocked, ready to use phone. Okay, so this is, where is this made? This is black. Uh, I don't know, let's see, is this... This phone is... Made in China. Assembled in China. China. Designed by Blue in Miami. Interesting, oh, so it's a US design phone. Assemble in China. Interesting. Let's open it up. Well, before we do that, in addition to this, I bought this what? combination of three SIM card adapters. Because I have a nano SIM card. And apparently this uh, phone takes a micro. Actually, it's a dual SIM phone. It takes a micro and a standard SIM which is pretty cool. So I bet you're waiting for me to open this baby up, right? Are you looking at me? So here it is. Hallelujah. For eighty dollars Canadian. So far, so good. No thrills. You know, it's not really. So it's a one point three gigahertz quad core processor, four gig of internal memory, five megapixel camera. That's fine. Doesn't matter. You can have a you uh, as a. Uh, uh, what we call it a micro SD card up to 64 gigs uh, selfie camera whatever that means I'm not gonna I don't care about these features Android 5.11 lollipop okay it's not the uh, 6.01 but uh, that's fine we can uh, we can live with that for now we we'll find a way to upgrade it to marshmallow what else we have here okay Charging cable, battery, charger, uh, dual SIM card installation guide, and user manual, and that's it. Ah, there we go. So this little notch at the bottom, at the uh, bottom right hand corner of the phone, the back. Open this up. I mean, it feels light feels a bit flimsy and cheap what but what do you expect for $80 it is cheap for $80 so here we go we have the micro SD let's put that in first we're gonna put the micro SD in wow okay, that's a micro SD and okay doesn't work then I'm gonna Complain. Writer review. Should I use the standard or the micro? Standard. Try the, let's try the standard one. Yay. Which I think is this guy. Hang on. Oh, no, this is not. That's, I, that's not the right one. Okay, let's try another one. Uh -oh. oh, boy. Oh. Okay. 
right, so there's a, there's a sticker here that's going to go on the back like this. I think it says no bow. The battery. And, well, SIM card and battery already. And put the pack back cover on. I'll just open it back up here to show you again. Okay, so battery goes here. This is the uh, SIM card. Let's just make sure it goes in properly. And let's try it to turn it on now. Okay, I'm going to turn it on. There's a, this button here is the power button, and then the volume buttons are there. Oh my god, it's light. It says bold like us. Blue. Power I'm not bold. Android. Blue. Okay. So, it's kind of neat so far. Okay, okay to, so. to explain you. To explain you. No, English. No, explain you. Next. Not sure. Insert SIM card. I didn't. Oh, I didn't catch the SIM card. Waste you. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Let's turn this off again. Pause. Power off. So, I tried the normal SIM slot here and it didn't work. So, we're going to put the um, nano SIM in the micro SIM slot instead. So, let's try. Yeah, put the cover back on. Uh, again, it feels very no frills. Let's press it harder. Whoop. Okay, here we go. Turning on again. Don't bold. tell me it's like, you know, Blackberry Bold, which I had one before. English, right? We want English. No, we want Spaniel. He's for Spanish. And activating cellular service. Ooh. This can take up to five minutes. Select Wi-Fi. It even... Obtaining IP address. Take, take up to two minutes. Why it would take two minutes, I don't know, but... There you go. Checking for Whoa. updates. So we connected. That was like 10 seconds, not even. Less. Checking info. Yay! So Whoa, that was let's onto go. Google. Okay. Let me set it all up and then we'll come back. Okay, I'll sign in with my Google account. It asked me to set my lock screen, which I say, okay, let's see. So what is it? Pattern. You have three choices. Pattern, pin, or password. I'm going to choose a pin. Okay. Next thing is notifications. Show all notification content. High sensitive notifications. Don't show notifications at all. Nah, let's show all. I have no sensitive ones. Google services, blah, 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 blah. Uh, help improve location. Hmm, back up your phone's apps. Okay, do that. Use Google's location service. Okay. Help improve locations. Like apps and scan for Wi Fi networks. I guess so. Help improve your Android right now. Sending diagnostic data to Google. Should I do that? Uh, maybe. Okay, let's do that. It doesn't matter. You probably will use more oh, data. Your lock screen, your new phone, your new everything. Welcome. Wallpapers, widgets, and settings. Touch and hold background to customize. Got it. Touch and hold this. Ooh. Oh, okay. Wait, well, take it's a just Android. Right. Take a picture. Take camera. a picture. Take a selfie. No camera. Let's see. Hold a second. Camera. Let's take a picture of this mess here. Oh. It's okay. Not too bad. Yeah, not the greatest quality, but I'm not using this phone for photos. Oh, I thought you did. No. I'm not. I don't really care about photos. It's right there. Oh, that's the back button? Yeah. Oh, it's nothing. Oh, okay. There's no buttons. Uh oh, I'm going to have to get used to this. There's no buttons at the bottom here. That the, it's You're too here. used to Samsung. Yeah, I am. This is the back button. This is the, I don't know what button. 
Like multitasking. Multitasking button. I'm going to have to get used to this. Phone. Speed dial. Dial. No, text messaging. Is this text? Oh, this is messaging. Okay. Play store. Show up. Show my apps. Oh, yeah, it does. It does. Kind of. It says really. all. Oh, yeah, okay. Let's go back first. Okay. So that's so far. Make sure you don't press the, the button, bottom. Right? That's like, the home button. Yeah. So nothing over here. That's the, well, that's the, what is it? The $600 difference. <laughs> yeah. With the Samsung, you're paying five or $600 for two buttons here. Plus a whole bunch of other features, I'm sure, but... So I have a page. I can't. <laughs> There's no pages right now. So what else? Can I go down? Settings? Wow. Wi-Fi data usage. Okay. Mm Interesting. Printing. Printing. No services installed. Okay, I gotta set up a lot of stuff here. Oh, you pressed it. Yeah. Oh yeah. Update prefer SIM card. Cool feature on this phone that we just just discovered is the FM radio, which I didn't have on my S six. So the way it works is okay. Start it, and for the antenna, you need a, a headphone, and we got our nifty. Headphone. <laughs> <laughs> so let's plug this in here. And then got the headphone in. And there we go. We got our station. First station that we were listening to. So we got speakers. Oh. We can go to the next station. I guess this will go up one step at a time. Please don't copyright this us. Will, this will go to the, the next station. That's pretty cool. Don't copyright us. To do with sleep, getting a good night's sleep. So that's a pretty good feature. Okay, let's we'll continue exploring.